At long last, the wait is over. A warm welcome to Wembley. This is Derek Ray, joined in the commentary box by Stuart Robson, and we're approaching kickoff time in what promises to be a spectacular FA Cup final. It's Arsenal versus Manchester United. Well, Derek, as a youngster growing up, this was the day that every young footballer dreamt of. Playing in the FA Cup final, walking out in front of 100,000 fans at Wembley, broadcast around the world, it still brings a tingle to my spine. Can he put it away? And he's outdone himself. Wonderful save there. So the corner played into the box and did his job defensively really good challenge Scott McTominay here is Fred Alex Tellez has it Fred with it Sancho and will they be able to play it in behind the defence Marcus Rashford. Jaden Sancho. And maybe Rashford. Terrific piece of anticipation. Lokonga. Could cross it in here. that final pass looking for the goal that would put them ahead a very effective challenge put in and the keeper in position to grab hold of it Cristiano Ronaldo Bruno Fernandes has it chance to cross Possession to give them the lead, maybe. Oh, yes! Manchester United have made the opening statement in this final. They take the lead. Well, we won't get tired of watching this because the interplay around the box is wonderful and there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. underway in this game Manchester United with the advantage and the timing was perfect ball one Cristiano Ronaldo read it superbly to take back possession Superb save. Well, he should score, of course, but that's a brilliant save. <laughs> Can someone get on the end of this? Relatively straightforward to mop up defensively. Bruno Fernandes, superb block on the back of the ball from the flank. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Defenders need to cover. Splendid tackle and a throw-in coming up. And space to cross it. Trying to chisel a chance out of it. It did look on for them, but not to be. 
Cristiano Ronaldo. Sancho. Bruno Fernandes. On to Ronaldo. And return to Rashford. Oh, that's a splendid piece of challenging. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Party. Defence of Brazilians to shut them down. Marcus Rashford. Rashford. Pass after pass, keeping their opponents moving. Sancho. Alex Tellez has it. The first half here comes to an end. Back underway with Arsenal trying to find a route back into the match. Tomiyasu. Well, it's one pass after another. Albert Sambi Lokonga. Lacazette. Alex Tellez has it. Harry Maguire now. Fred. Well, they're quite content to knock it around inside their own half. Rashford. Rashford. Bruno Fernandes. Bruno Fernandes has it. Possession one. And the counter looks on here. Options available. Getting forward. Partey. Good effort here. It's one of the saves of the season from De Gea. And United will switch things around personnel wise. To be replaced by number 14, Pierre Emerick Abamian. Substitution for Manchester United. Coming off the pitch, number 10, Marcus. It's a short one. Coming onto the pitch, 21, Edinson. Okayo Saka. It's with Gabriel. Aubameyang. Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. Oh, a goal! He's equalised! Was he made for moments like this? On an occasion like this? Well, as you can see, he has to get rid of that quicker. That's a poor mistake from the keeper. Business once more on the back of that very important equaliser. 1-1. One, one. Well, United have certainly controlled the ball, as you can see. But in terms of creating chances, they've been well below their normal standards. Unless that changes quickly, it's going to be a really frustrating day for them. Excellent passing. Oh, good play, this. Can he finish? Well, as you can see here, the build-up 
up is patient, it's precise and penetrative, which opens up the opposition. And the finish is clinical. It just makes it look so easy, doesn't it? Well, a dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. White. Thomas. Ben White. Thomas Partey. Well, he likes to run at them. A meaty but fair challenge, and it will be a throw-in. Here's a change for Manchester United. Partey has lost it. Donny van der Beek. And breaking at pace with Menace. Diogo Dano. How about the cross? Well, that's how to break the spirit of the attacker. Really good reading of the game to win possession back. And a crucial intervention inside the box. Promising looking ball. Martin Odegaard, United regaining possession. He takes aim, and somehow kept out by De Gea. Well, a corner it is, and they know they've got to be opportunistic at this stage of the game. And they're making a change. Can someone get on the end of this? And he did what he had to do defensively. Can they hit on the break? We're taking into account all the stoppages. Three minutes to be added on. Just failing to hit the target with his pass. And it'll be a throw-in. Substitution time it is here. Thomas Partey and Aubameyang now Granit Xhaka and there goes the final whistle the cup issue is settled a story of one side celebrating and the other distraught memories are being made well just look at those scenes down there Derek what a contrast in emotions Brilliant for the winners, despair for the losers. But overall, the right team won today. Yeah, you can see what it means to this tight-knit team. Real solidarity. Well, this is special for everybody at the club. What a great moment for any young player. And this is what you dream about when you start playing football. When you're playing in the playground, you want to win a cup. Brilliant moment. Yes, a special moment in the career of any footballer. And now for the trophy lift itself. The cup winners. Well, you can just see what it means to those players and the manager. That's fantastic stuff. There's always the element of chance in a cup competition. But my goodness, they've taken the rough with the smooth. And now they savour the moment. Full mark.